The facility will act as a new entrance for the airport, and they're calling it the Flight Center. We want them to drive down I Street and see this amazing facility from the street and uh, say, well, they have a restaurant there, let's go in there. And then while they're in there, uh, see how neat flying is and uh, maybe get the itch and, and, uh, and start down uh, the path of becoming a pilot. The flight center will replace the existing airport entrance and will include amenities such as a museum, restaurant, and conference rooms. I uh, would definitely utilize a restaurant and conference center. The new facility is designed to bring public awareness to the airport and engage aviation enthusiasts. It's private uh, airplane owners who um, are flying around the country and whether they're stopping through here to get fuel or lunch, uh, to continue on to a different destination or they're coming here to see the uh, beautiful things that we have here in Northwest Arkansas. Summit Aviation hopes to inspire a new generation of pilots with its museum. They plan to showcase fresh exhibits on a quarterly basis. There'll be a rotating uh, showcase that comes through there. We may have um, backcountry flying uh, one quarter which will have you know Bush airplanes um, and we may have World War II fighters uh, the next quarter. Tonight's meeting, which wrapped up just behind me, was kind of the final step in giving this project the green light, and it did indeed get approval. Live in Bentonville, Christopher Redfern, 4029 News.